Welcome back, aspiring entrepreneurs. Yes, you have heard it right. I failed three businesses because not implementing this in my business. In this video, we are going to cover brand positioning. It's not just about where you stand in the market. It's about craving out a unique space in the minds of your customers. It's the art of differentiating the brand from competitors and aligning it perfectly with your target audience needs and desires. First off, identifying your competitors. Knowing your competitors is the first step in craving out your unique space in the market. It's about understanding who you are up against, their strengths, their weakness, and their strategies. By analyzing your direct and indirect competitors, you gain insights into market gaps consumer preferences and areas where you can excel in. For example, use tools like Google and industry reports to create a list of your main competitors. Analyze your online presence, customer review and service offerings. Look for patterns in customer feedback and identify gaps where your brand can deliver superior value. Strongly recommend you to create a comprehensive competitor analysis document include their product range, pricing strategies, market approach research, and customer sentiments. Pinpoint areas where they excel and where they fall flat. Use this information to shape your unique selling proposition and strategic advantages. Step 2. Discovering your differentiators. So differentiators are the unique attributions that set your brand apart from the competition. They are the reasons why your customer choose you over others. Your differentiators could be your innovative products, exceptional service, unique brand story, or a combination of these factors. For example, consider how Dollar Shave Club disrupted the razor market with its subscription model and how Tesla redefined the car industry with its high-end electric sports car. These brands identified unique differentiators and built their entire business model around them. So, I strongly recommend you to reflect deeply on what makes your brand unique. It could be your product quality, customer service, pricing, or even your brand values. Ensure your differentiators are valuable to your target audience and consistently highlight in your marketing and branding efforts. Thirdly, knowing your audience. So, Understanding your audience is crucial for effective brand positioning. It's about knowing their preferences, pain points, aspirations, and behavior. By aligning your brand with your audience needs and values, you create a deep emotional connection and foster brand loyalty. For example, Amazon's promise of a wide range of products with a quick delivery aligns perfectly with the needs of online shoppers looking for convenience and variety. Apple's emphasis on innovation and design resonates with tech-savvy individuals who value style and functionality. I strongly recommend you to conduct market research to gather insights about your target audience. Create detailed buyer persona representing your ideal customer. Use these personas to guide your product development, market strategies, and customer service approach, ensuring that every aspect of your brand resonates with your audience expectations and preferences. I've created videos on how to create detailed target audience and buyer persona within 10 minutes, which I will put it in the description below. Trust me, it will blow your mind and it's worth your time. Lastly, crafting a positioning statement. So, a positioning statement is a concise declaration of your brand's unique value and how it fulfills the needs of your target audience. It's a guiding light for your market strategies and a powerful tool for communicating your brand's essence to the world. For example, Amazon's positioning statement highlights its commitment to a one-stop online shopping experience with quick delivery. It sets apart from other online retailers. Apple's positioning statement focuses on innovation, design, and impact, distinguishing it from other tech companies. Strongly recommend you to craft your positioning statement. Start by describing your target audience and the specific needs you address. 
articulate your brand's unique benefits and how you deliver them. Finally, explain what sets you apart from your competitor and how you make your unique value proposition possible. Ensure your positioning statement is clear, concise, and aligns with the brand's core values and vision. Now, share your thoughts in the comment section below. What is your business about? Now, you have understood brand positioning, one out of the four pillars to build a successful brand. In the description below, I will link up the remaining videos. Be sure to watch all of them to build a successful brand in 2024 and earn your first 10k per month. As we conclude this session, remember that brand positioning is not a one-time task, but a continuous process of adapting and evolving with market dynamics and consumer preferences. And this is all for today's video. Thank you all for staying to the end. Kindly like this video if you have learned anything from it. And comment any questions you have. Have a nice day, Ali. See you next time.